Since its inception in 1685, Toy Canning and Spencer has been synonymous with the production of civil and military identity products. Still family run, its longevity is built on the foundation of superb craft skills, quality and service combined with a modern design capability that exploits the latest technology. The company's unique infrared capability is a direct consequence of the combination of this long track record and cultural approach. Working with Master Technologies, based at the University of Bradford, Toy Kenning & Spencer has developed infrared yarns that can be identified at night or in the dark at up to 200 meters using infrared vision equipment or even off-the-shelf CCTV cameras that incorporate infrared LEDs. They can be woven with conventional textile yarns to produce badges, patches, insignia, labels, panels, webbing, and even woven fabric by the meter. These products can be used in many applications, including night landing pads, vehicle roofs, and covert and overt insignia in workwear. The color of the infrared yarn can be chosen to match the uniform, making it only visible under infrared illumination, which is ideal for covert operations. For overt operations, using the colored infrared yarns, any flag, motif or call sign can be woven as a patch or badge that's visible in daylight and in the dark. The infrared yarns can also be combined with infrared retro-reflecting yarns to give higher visibility at greater distance. The degree of reflectivity can be controlled by changing the balance between the reflecting and the absorbing yarns, which means identification can be tailored to the operational environment. What's more, being retro-reflecting, these badges and patches give strong infrared signals even at acute angles. Current infrared retro-reflective badges are printed onto rigid plastic, which is not flexible and has limited durability. It also has extremely high reflectance, which means that when it's being viewed using infrared vision systems, it can give an infrared blot, making it very difficult to distinguish the identity or pattern of a badge. Unlike Toy, Kenning and Spencer's retro-reflecting badges, the degree of reflectance cannot be controlled. Toy, Kenning and Spencer's infrared capabilities were recognized at IDEX 2011, when its badges were named Best at Show by security companies.